get started. All right, let's get some questions. How old is Chelsea? I feel like there was probably some pretty righteous makeup sex after the whole Monica thing. Probably mid nineties, mid nineties then. I guess is what we're going with here. Mid late nineties. Oh, oh God! You know, that guy's making the amount of he makes on a speech. He must just be pimping out oh, like Jay Z, man. He's like, I kind of want to look up his fucking net worth right now. It's gonna be worth the shit, though. Should check out check out Bill Clinton's net worth. I'm kind of curious what that is. No. Yeah, I wonder what he even does anymore. I mean, he just goes around giving speeches and makes shitloads of money. Net worth of eighty million dollars. Wow. Eighty mil bill sitting up. I don't think presidents was like the best topic for me. <laughs> but no, just, I was just, I was just, yeah, just got into Hillary and Bill. I'm like, I don't know. Bill was awesome, man. He was. We don't care what the fuck Bill did. When we were kids. He was just the man. Truth, right now, I guess it's easier. Ah, uh, dare. Is that just the whole question itself? My dad had a big bushy mustache when we got married. Throughout the 90s, my dad was rocking a big thick stash. Probably never. Yeah, I, don't, I mean, I wouldn't for you. I don't know, I've seen some hockey teams like go through the playoffs with some wicked mustaches. Like, it'd be awesome to just be like on a team of guys I feel like there are a few, absurd mustaches. A few professions where it's acceptable to have a mustache. Used car salesman. Narrator of a western movie. Yeah. Hockey player, porn star. Hockey player, porn star. That's about it. Yeah. Hitler really ruined the mustache, I think. I think he played a big part in it. After Hitler, there was really only one diameter of mustache that yeah. was still acceptable. It, it had like to be at least this or longer, you know? Yeah, <laughs> like, into the handlebar. Yeah, it would have to be a pretty unique, unique circumstance to, to get the stash. I, feel, I, mean, I feel like college is the right time to experiment with facial hair, though. Of course, yeah, yeah. or you can. Shaming takes about a half hour. Like. Maybe not half hour, 15, 25 minutes. It takes a while. I'm not gonna put that on you, man. <laughs> Just today, actually, ironically, I got <coughs> a heart shaped pizza and heart shaped small piece of cheesecake. And that was pretty awesome, man. Deep dish pizza and mail, but. Honestly, enjoying the dry ice more beforehand than came with the package, just throwing it into cups of water and watching the bubble, which is surprisingly entertaining. Yeah, Valentine's Day is a very commercial artificial holiday. Absolutely. And it's very marketed in one direction towards women. There's not really Valentine's Day stuff for dudes. Like, <laughs> yeah, there's not really a lot of like. Red roses, like. I'll eat chocolate. Cho Chocolates are cool. Wrong, I need to send my mom some shit for Valentine's Day. You do not. That shit, that is weird. I'm supposed to say, like, Happy Valentine's Day, Mama, I love you. It's not, it's not good. I'm not gonna give my mom a fucking card. I'm not gonna get her chocolates. I don't know. Like, my, mom expects a car. my mom expects a card and some chocolates. So that's that's crazy. That is weird. I don't know. That's actually a really good question. Probably pancakes. I'm not a big pancake person. The waffle, the waffle sucks actually, because the waffle you need a fucking machine to do it. It's a machine, it's machine generated as opposed true. to the pancake, you need, you need a, which you is need a natural, plans. it's a natural thing that you make with yourself and your spatula. You, you know what? Fuck the waffle. I didn't realize I cared so much about this. I mean, I like the syrup as a horse, like that's nice. It definitely, it seeps into the waffle evenly. But pancakes are, yeah, it's like your own crap. Pancakes are a much deeper breakfast item. I have a waffle iron at home. I'm a waffles girl. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we are now mortal enemies. They can cook so really well in waffle batter. That's like one of the best things. Just crumble bacon. It's pretty good. I want to just make bacon wrapped steak. Every item has bacon. I would make bacon wrapped steak. And then we'll have, we'll have some cheerios or something. Yeah. For Sarah. I've literally built like a Catholic intolerance in my brain to little literature. I literally started reading it. Dude, the Pope's signs. Really? Did you not hear that? When did this happen? Like yesterday. Oh shit, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No idea. Pretty sure it's like one of the first times it's ever happened before. Usually they die. Yeah, usually they die. It's usually like a lifelong gig. Old weather self didn't go very well for like the Twitter new face of Catholicism. Uh, oh yeah, they did get like social media, didn't they? Yeah, they started a Twitter this year. <laughs> it was just hilarious. I'd love to be the staff of the, the Vatican social media. Vatican social media? Imagine that. I don't know if I meant to watch this. Yeah, I kind of do, but who knows? <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, if my grandmother just saw that, she would probably die instantly. The fact that she contributed DNA 
to the thing that just said that would probably stop her heart. <laughs> <laughs>